Mary Curtis was born in 1936. She was always independent and she was always had other people's welfare at heart. And meeting Mary Curtis, right away I noticed her wonderful accent, uh, her gentle way of speaking, her smile, and her way of being right from the get-go. I loved her, you know, sense of adventure and willingness to do anything. I told her it was her turn. And so we made another move to Southern Oregon. In 1988, she began her job at SOU. And I remember when I met Mary Curtis, I just had the idea of like whatever that human is doing, I want to be a part of. What she was to us is she was a beacon of light. You know, I often say that she's our North Star. Her dedication to protecting that world for children, I think was very, very unique and kind of rare in this world. 